With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello everyone, the question is, a moving point P moves such that AP square plus BP square equal to 10, where the coordinates of the points A and B are respectively 2 comma 3 comma minus 4 and 0 comma 0 comma 1. So in this question, we are supposed to find the locus of this moving point P and we are given the coordinates of AB and relation between the points A, P and B. Okay, so let us assume that this is my point P whose coordinates are X, Y and Z. This is my point A which is given to me as 2, 3, minus 4 and this is my point B whose coordinates are 0, 0, 1. So we are given that this AP distance square plus this BP distance square is equal to 10. So let me apply this here. So AP square plus BP square is equal to 10. By using distance formula, we can find the distance between two points. So according to the, and it is a square. So according to distance formula, I am writing the value of AP square. That will be X minus 2 whole square plus y minus 3 whole square plus z and here it is minus 4. So minus minus becomes plus plus 4 whole square. This is the value of ap square. Now the value of bp square I can write as x minus 0 whole square. So that is x square. Similarly y minus 0 whole square will be y square and third term will be z minus 1 whole square equal to 10. Now let us simplify this expression. So I will get x square minus 4x plus 4 plus y square minus 6x plus 9 plus z square plus 8z plus 16 plus x square plus y square plus z square minus 2z plus 1 equal to 10. Now we can see x square here also x square so 2x square. Similarly, y square also twice and z square also twice. Now, for x terms, I have minus 4x. For y, I have minus 6y and z is plus 6z. And the constant terms sum up to 30 equal to 10. I will bring this 10 here. So, I will get 2x square plus 2y square plus 2z square minus 4x minus 6y plus 6z minus plus 30 minus 10 will be 20 equal to 0. See, we can see a common multiple of 2. So, I am dividing this equation by 2. So, I will get x square plus y square plus z square minus 2x minus 3y plus 3z plus 10 equal to 0. So, the equation which we have got, this is the locus of point P and this is my final answer. Thank you. For class 6 to 12, ITG and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.